Hello, what's up, guys? So I thought it'd be time to show you how to install mods in Euro Truck Simulator 2, as many has been asking for that. And well, it's very easy, so I'm just gonna show you this real quick. First, you can go into like your favorite uh, ETS2 mod site. My mine is ETS2.lt. There is also like lots of other sites like ets2planet.com and ets2mods.com and stuff. You can use Google ets2mods and you will see a lot of different uh, kinds of websites. So here we are in ets2.lt and my favorite mod maker is this guy, Cragebaum. So if you want to check out his work, just go ahead and search for that. And unfortunately, by some odd reason, the latest one isn't in the top. As you see here, it says 2013 and here 2014 and so on. So it seems, or actually now they seem to be, yeah, the, the first one is uh, wrong, but the other ones are right. You see here November 16th, November 9th, and then November 3rd. So yeah, now it's sorted out. I don't know. What the hell? Um, but just ignore that first one. So just select a um, mod, what, like whatever, like this one. This is his latest one. Just a few days ago, we uploaded this one. Actually, many other guys made this one, but he makes some awesome sound mods and stuff. Yeah, and you just go ahead and click download. And once you got the download, you need to go ahead and go to your documents, Euro Truck Simulator 2, and mod folder, and just place it in here. Sometimes when you download it, it comes in a zip or RAR package. Then you need either WinRAR or 7-zip, which is free, to unpackage it and place it in here. And sometimes there's even like, uh, they tell you in the comments, if you're having trouble installing the mod, they tell you to put the whole RAR in here for some other reason. And I've tried that earlier and it works, but it's only on some certain mods. And once you've done that, go ahead and open up the game. And now as you see we're in the game here and the version is 1.14.2s So it looks a little bit different now, they've changed some things here, I haven't played for a while uh, Anyway, go ahead and click on your profile and click edit profile So yeah, we're not done yet, yet. There's also another thing you might want to do depending on what mod you got But here you can select the mods that you have in the mod folder Once you have selected them you click apply and they will be applied to the game. But for example here, there, this is a truck, so you, you see this one, Russia map, they are pretty easy to see like where the map is, you just open up the map and you can see where it is. Also by the way, if you have a download of the map and you want to be able to teleport to different places in the map, then there is a, like a free view mode and a button you, and a button you can press to teleport your truck actually. And to do that, well, I don't really remember, but I will put it in the description below if you're interested. Anyway, as I was going to say with a truck, if you got a truck, sometimes they're not very clear on where you can get it. So you got to, you got to apply it to the game, and now you need to find it. So the first thing I would do is look in the download the website where I downloaded it. Say, check the download description and see if they mentioned like in Scania dealer or in uh, like whatever dealer it might be. Uh, if it doesn't say that, look in the comments. If it still doesn't say it in the comments, you might want to search the mod on another website and look there if it says any more info. Otherwise, you know, just go ahead and check all the different dealers and you will eventually find it. So yeah, that's about it for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed. Um, as I said, many have been asking for this and I've been replying to many messages telling you guys how to do this. But as you see, clearly it's very easy. But there is these small things that may, many people don't know and might get stuck up on. So please, uh, yeah, don't forget to leave me a like, comment and subscribe. To By the way, I think I will do a Euro Truck Simulator 2 video really soon with some of those nice Grage Bomb mods. Uh, hopefully I will do like two different trucks in one, one video so it won't get that boring. Also I'm gonna do some Assetto Corsa of course. So yeah, see you guys later in the next video. Take care. Although I love the sound from looking outside of the car like now. That's cool. That sounds pretty, pretty awesome, man. I wish they could bring that a little bit.